I've been needing some color in my life, as winter is kind of gray and gloomy here. I started off with some pink wax pastel, moving loosely and randomly in my art journal. I followed that with a Stabilo Woody in orange, holding the pencil loosely so it's difficult to control. Then I used some ink and moved it around with a wet brush. I'm working intuitively with no particular end result in mind, just moving the brush where I'm drawn to move it. Then I used some Neo Color crayons in orange and pink. I used them in several different ways. Dry, activating them with a wet paint brush, and also by dipping the crayon in water. I love the rich, deep color I get when I dip the crayon in water. It's nice that this art supply is very versatile, and I got a variety of marks with the same crayon. some black to contrast, so I drew a couple of loose roundish shapes with a black Stabilo Woody. Then next was some lemon yellow with a palette knife. I love the combination of pink with yellow. There's something about those two colors beside each other that makes me happy and cheerful. Perfect for a grey winter day. I put the pops of yellow in several places on the page to draw your eyes around to different spots. I used some white to tone down some areas and to get some blending going. I used a small brush and also a silicone color shaper for the white. some ink on the page and moved it around with a color shaper, enjoying the feel of how it flowed and moved around the page. It also mixed with the white paint in some places, which gave a different look. of yellow then I let it dry for a while. At this point the art journal spread was definitely bright and had happy colors but I was starting to doubt myself and felt like it looked messy and unappealed. As I looked it over in the next couple of days this phrase flowers in winter kept coming into my head so I was like okay that doesn't really make sense but I'll add those words to the page. Off camera, I messed around with it the next day, adding some peachy pink in more areas to mask some of the messy parts and get rid of some of the white. Going with the flowers theme, I turned some of the colorful areas into flower-like shapes using several different shades of pink. At the end, I added in some more black petal-like lines and made the words darker again. In the end, I actually liked it. I enjoyed using the bright colors and being in the flow of painting intuitively. I was able to brighten up my days and forget about the grey weather. Spring is right around the corner, hopefully, so until then I have my winter flowers. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and are encouraged to play around with your favourite colours of paint. Don't worry about the result. 
Some days you'll like what you make, other days you won't. The important thing is that you enjoy the process of creating.